You can see the blaze of a Verrett house fire through Fire Station 10's front window, but no trucks and no firefighters from this station will respond because it's been closed for two years. Elaine Johnson and her neighbors said this is what they've been fearing. Well, since they took it from here, because really it should be here. St. Bernard Fire Chief Thomas Stone said there was a 10 minute window Sunday between the first call for help at 8.59 p.m. and when the first unit arrived. He said no one was home and no firefighters were hurt. A former St. Bernard firefighter who did not want to be identified warned resources are stretched too thin. The people want things fixed and the firemen are dying to get things fixed, but they just, they have no one to help them. Fire Station 10 is one of two firehouses in the parish that are now closed. According to the fire chief, general fund dollars that used to run the department were replaced by a property tax millage in 2012. And he says by 2018, the department couldn't afford to keep all of its stations open. No stations. You know, it was an operational decision and a reorganization. Stone plans to ask voters in St. Bernard to renew the millage next year before it expires in 2022. But the fire chief says he won't ask for a tax increase because he says taxpayers can't afford it. Our insurance rating improved to a class two parish wide. That's probably the best parish wide fire insurance rating in the state of Louisiana. And what about in those areas that are near those two fire stations that closed? Was their fire protection affected? Well, if I had my way, you'd have a fire station in every neighborhood, but that's not realistic. The fire chief also told me that the fire station two in Araby has two other firehouses very close by. He said that one will likely never reopen. I also talked to the newly elected council rep for the district in the Verrett's fire station area. That's Fred Everhart. He said reopening station 10 in Verrett is quote a must do. And he says he'll work with the parish to see if money can be moved from its budget to supplement the fire department. Back to you.